So, Pocahontas, her life story is actually not like the movie. Her legendary rescue of the English captain, John Smith, was most likely part of a traditional Indian adoption ceremony. But some people don't think that she actually saved John Smith. Some people say that if she hadn't saved John Smith, that he would have been killed. So that's why many of the people in Jamestown looked up to her. Her Indian name is Matoaka, which means playful. And during this time that she lived, she learned the English language and was baptized by a Christian, and she took on the name Rebecca. Um, she died at 21 years old because of smallpox, so she was very young when she died. She married John Rolfe and had no relationship with John Smith. She was kidnapped by Christians and ended up converting to Christianity. And her Christian name was Rebecca, like we already covered. She had a son with John Rolfe named Thomas. John Rolfe later on took a group of people to London, including Pocahontas and her son, and their son. And the royalty in London actually really liked Pocahontas, so they invited her to parties and different events. And while she was in London, she found out that John Smith was there, so she started looking for him and trying to see him again and connect with him. And he ignored her for a long time, but when he finally came to see her, she was being rude. And she was too hurt by him to be friendly. And then after that, they never spoke again. And she died. Some sources say that she never saved John Smith, like I already said. All other, other sources say that when she was younger, she was raped and she had one child who she had to give away. And some say that John Rolfe only married her for tobacco production because she was a Native American. So when she moved to London, her life seemed a lot better than it was when she was in America because she was so likable. So since she was so likable, it kind of showed how um, she played a significant role in the beginning of, in the early times of Jamestown. So since she saved John Smith and was very liked by the royalty when she moved to London, she played a big part in the early times of Jamestown by saving him and by being likable. The significance about her early events, the early events in her life, show how she got to know, like how she met her husband and um, what she went through when she was younger. And the significance of her death is to show that she did not live for that long, but she still made a big impact in the times that she was alive, in the small time that she was alive. So in all, as a little summary, Pocahontas, some say she did save John Smith, some say she didn't. She had to convert to Christianity when she was taken or abducted. She learned the English, English language and was baptized by these people that abducted her. And then she took on the name Rebecca. She then moved to London with her husband and her child, and the royalty really liked her, so they invited her to everything. And then she tried to find John Smith, he didn't find her, and then when he finally found her, she was too mad, so then they never spoke again. And then lastly, she died because of smallpox when she was 20 years old. 